Are these the ones that need to move? Yeah. Hello, Joe. Darcy, how are you? Good, how are you? Oh, I'm... Oh, oh don't fall. Don't I'm fall. stiff. Oh, were you sitting? Yes. Oh. Is there anything in the way? I don't know. I'm just the camera person. Well, for now, I could pull this one out. I could pull these two out. Uh -huh. And you know, once, this one, this section here, I think yeah. we probably can just leave it. I'll pull it out. Might as well then pull it out. Okay. Gotta move it anyway. Yeah. It won't take but a short little bit to pull it out. Alright folks, well we got a job to do today. We've got an old friend of the family and he's a wood carver. Um, my mother-in-law belongs to Sons of Norway and he does a lot of carving for them. The diorama that my wife has, he built an actual Viking longboat and he had some trees fall down in his yard and a big windstorm this spring or winter and I've agreed to come out and mill those up for him. He just didn't want to see those get destroyed. And, you know, so I said, well, Joe, how about this? How about I go ahead and I mill those up for you? So we're going to go and we're going to get those milled up for him. All right, here we go. I came out here in the spring and I moved some of the logs for him and then came out here yesterday and used my Jeep to go ahead and kind of drag those logs into a little bit better place. But there's gonna, we're gonna have to do some work. They're, they're gonna need some bucking and all kinds of stuff, so. All right, let's have a look and see how close we are. I need to be centered on that big log, the log clamp. here. So you got gloves on? Yeah. Okay. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this, like this, okay, and, and just go and brush the top off, right? Then you wanna brush this and make that nice and greasy. And then after you do the top and that one, come under like this and do this one too. Make it nice and greasy, okay? Landon, you want a job? Okay, so there's a metal detector, right? So I'm gonna turn it on, and I'm gonna lift it up, and then I'm gonna try to check on the metal. Okay, point that at the metal. Feel that? Yeah. Now, start on the back log, and go up and down the log, and see if you can find any metal in all these logs because we don't want to cut any nails. And I know there's some metal in some of them. Teach them young. You found one? Okay, point that out, there you go. So you are Joel, right? Yeah. Joel, okay. You let Joel know so he can get a hammer and pull those out, okay? okay. Good job. That saves a band. Every band we hit with a nail costs us. Um, once we start milling, we'll be checking each log. When you get all the way to here, I'll move this out of the way here in a minute. 
But you can do the under one and make sure you, the chain's good. Did you already do the chain? Mm -hmm. Okay, did you do underneath? Yeah, I did the under. Oh, okay. So you still got oil in there? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. Coming back. Let's kick all of this stuff out of the way here. And we're gonna have to roll these logs back a little bit so I can drop that down. Okay, hold off on moving that one. We're gonna leave it there because we gotta lube up the mill still. Wanna use a chainsaw? So I'm gonna let you use a little bit because you don't have chaps or proper boots, but I'll, I'll let you try a little bit with it. The way this works, you see this button? Yeah. You push the button in, mm -hmm. you pull the trigger after you go like that. Mm -hmm. Now, try to get the saw underneath that. Like that? No, under it. No, I won't kick back. Yeah. Now, you see how the log is now between you and the saw? Yeah. That's gonna be safer, right? What you, <laughs> it's, it's heavy, huh? Yeah. It's hard to do, when, when, but it's a good time to learn. The key is you gotta let the saw do all the work and you don't wanna turn it while you're doing it. So what you wanna do is come in here, set it on there, and then try to let the saw do all the work for you. You see how I'm doing that? Yeah. You want to try to finish it off? Yeah. Okay, so you hold it there. Okay, okay. pull the trigger. Hold on to it, pull the trigger. There you go. Just let the weight of the saw go down. Okay, let go, let go. There you go, see that? Easy peasy. Inch and a half, inch and three quarters. So you want what? one here? It looks like it has some real beautiful wood. Mm hmm. Good, yeah. Why don't you put some inch and a half? Inch and a half, so. Inch and three quarters, like you told yesterday. Inch and three quarters, okay. Why don't you some inch and three quarters? As wide as I can get it? Yeah. Okay. Wide as I can go, inch and three quarters. You got it. Okay. So we're here at Joe's place. We got these logs to get taken care of. We're gonna knock them out. First, I gotta buck the ends off of this one. Then we're gonna go with inch and three quarters as wide as I can get them. So, should be pretty easy. Get her up, knock her down, get the next one. Let's get to it. All right, here we go. Lift the first one up. 
Lift the first one up all the way. Hold it hard. Hard. There you go. Hard at it. Hard at it. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Stop. Stop. Ready? So what you do is you lift that after I get it past there, okay? Just lift it up a couple inches. Okay, lift it. There you go. Good. Good. That's 10 and a half, huh? Almost 11. So we gotta lift up. Okay, stand back. Give me some room. We get loud now.
lever up, up, watch it, watch it, stop. Now pull back, pull it, hold it, hold it. Okay, stop, let go. And now push the down lever, down. This one, this one, let go. Now look, now look down. Are we gonna hit the stop? No, green layer, okay. Now, on, forward. Now watch, watch it, keep your eye out. Look down there, okay, looking good. Now get up there, get up there. Put your hands on there, or you can hold like right here. Pull back. Pull back, pull back. Come on, let go, let go. And down, see, down. Just hit it, there you go, just hit it. Just one time, hit it. Okay, now, now this one, go watch this. Okay, looks good, okay. Forward, okay, now watch, watch it. And just tap back, just tap, just tap it. There you go, like that. Keep going, and, and look, look. Oh yeah, you're good. Now pull it back. There you go. A little more, a little more, and a little more. Keep going. A little more. Watch the log. See where the band is. All right. Now down. Just tap it down. Let go. Let go. It's gonna do it automatic. Now we gotta look. Oh, we're getting close. So now, come back here, come back here. We're getting close, right? So, I just move those down. All right, there we go. Engage the blade, blade up, push forward, watch, watch. that one, and then up, and then back, okay, come all the way back here, pull back hard, pull back hard, there you go, now let go, now let go, now stop, now just stop, now, what you do is come a little further back, right there, okay, now, you can go down, but don't do anything else, and we're going to push them off, okay,
Got a little bullet pine going on. A little bit of bugs, a little bit of sap. Actually, that's awesome. Okay. The guys with the wood. Well, it's not for sale. Wow, I can see why. It's very special. The, na the, the name of it is Midnight Sun Sunset. And it's a loose interpretation of their Mulvig area. Very loose. Very loose. Since 2017. January, February 2017. That's there, that painting there of the. Mm -hmm. I had it at the trailer. This one? Yeah. What is it? That's fine, but yeah. if you were to cut this flat, cut a flat edge here uh -huh. on both of these, yes, it's book matched. Oh, but how up. would you do that? Because it looks really cool. Yeah. All right, folks, we got her done. I didn't count the board foot, it was 10 logs. Had a couple that caused me a little stress today. Some, just a bunch of big knots and uh, I had to try uh, Jake Dean's trick of just turning the lube off and going even slower than I normally would. Barely pushing the mill ahead. Well, I'm not pushing it, but it's driving itself, but uh, managed to get through them. <laughs> Crazy though, but yeah, turning off the, the water lube actually helped sometimes. So that, that was kind of fun. Um, had some logs that uh, I read them, said the stress is this way, started cutting them and went, yep, stress is doing exactly what I expected it to do. And then it turned on me 90 degrees. So I went from having face bends to crowns. And so I had to flip those cans around and cut them the other way. And sometimes you got to do that. Sometimes this life of the tree changes what it's going to do. So, wow, what a day. Had a great day, had a lot of fun. Hopefully you saw that boat that Joe made and his, uh, little, his little art museum here. We'll make sure you see that and uh, check that out. I think you'll enjoy it. Joe's a great guy. Loved coming out here and milling for him. So folks, I'm done for today. It's Bourbon 30. I'll drop a video right here for you to check out. Y'all have a great day. The old jar head out. <laughs>